Have you ever wondered what happens to the wastewater after it goes down the drain? Well, it embarks on a journey through a complex network of pipes and pumps, eventually leading to a wastewater treatment plant. Here, it undergoes several stages of purification to remove harmful substances, protecting our environment and public health. You see, wastewater treatment isn't just about cleaning up the water, it's about maintaining an environmental balance and safeguarding our communities from diseases. However, traditional wastewater treatment methods aren't without their challenges. They can be energy-intensive, costly, and sometimes ineffective at removing certain pollutants. Plus, they often produce sludge that needs to be disposed of responsibly. These limitations highlight the need for more efficient, eco-friendly solutions. While we've made strides in wastewater treatment, there's still room for improvement. One promising solution lies in the field of nanotechnology. But what exactly is nanotechnology? Great question. In the simplest terms, nanotechnology is the science of the incredibly small. We're talking about things so tiny they're measured in nanometers which are one billionth of a meter. Imagine a strand of hair, then imagine something a hundred thousand times thinner. That's the size we're dealing with here. Nanotechnology involves manipulating and controlling matter at this nanoscale to create new properties and enhance performance. It's like having a magic wand that can change the behavior of atoms and molecules. And this isn't some far-off sci-fi concept, it's happening right now, in labs all over the world. The applications are as diverse as they are astounding. From delivering targeted medicines within the human body, to creating faster and more powerful electronics, Nanotechnology is shaping our future in the most exciting ways. Intriguing, isn't it? Now let's dive into how nanotechnology is revolutionizing wastewater treatment. How does nanotechnology apply to wastewater treatment, you ask? Well, it's quite fascinating. Nanoparticles, which are incredibly small structures with dimensions less than 100 nanometers, can be used to remove pollutants from wastewater. You see, these nanoparticles have a high surface area to volume ratio. This allows them to interact with a larger number of contaminants, making the process of pollutant removal more efficient. And it's not just about efficiency. Nanotechnology can also tackle even the tiniest contaminants that traditional methods struggle to eliminate. These could be harmful bacteria, viruses, or other micropollutants. But the story doesn't end here. The field of nanotechnology is evolving and scientists are constantly researching to find more effective and sustainable ways to apply it in wastewater treatment. The advantages are numerous, but it's important to remember that like any other technology, nanotechnology too has its challenges. It's a complex science and its full potential is yet to be unlocked. Nanotechnology holds great potential for wastewater treatment, but it's not without challenges. So what have we learned today? In the face of rising global water scarcity and pollution, wastewater treatment has emerged as a critical issue. We've understood the challenges it presents, Chiefly, the need to remove various contaminants to make water safe for reuse or return to the environment. We've also delved into the fascinating world of nanotechnology, exploring its basic principles and potential applications. We've seen that these microscopic particles can be engineered to interact with contaminants in unique ways, potentially revolutionizing wastewater treatment. Most importantly, we've seen how nanotechnology is already being applied in this arena, promising a more efficient and comprehensive solution to the challenges of wastewater treatment. From targeted pollutant removal to improved filtration techniques, the potential is immense. Nanotechnology could be the future of wastewater treatment, offering a more efficient and comprehensive solution. But as with any technology, it requires careful study and responsible use. Thanks for tuning in to Aminulkum Innovation. Share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.